English conversation made easy. Session 8 1. Telephone talk Hi. Am I talking to Mr. Gupta? Yes, this is Mr. Gupta speaking. Tell me. This is with regard to your complaint of your internet connection. That's right. I'm quite vexed. When will you get it fixed? We apologize for this inconvenience. Our network has been afflicted due to the incessant weather. These rains can be a boon or either curse, but you must work on it. It's your duty. This storm came out of the blue. We are working on it as we speak. I assure you. I appreciate that. Thank you very much for your call. 2. Discussing Cricket That was a spectacular catch. Two wickets left. This is the last over and six runs are required. Who do you think will win? Sush. Let me concentrate. I am on the edge of my seat. Everything is set. My team is going to win. My bet will bear fruit. Your team may be the apple of your eye. But if the batsman hits the bat hard enough, the ball will be out of the ground. Your next batsman can't even run. He will stagger to even reach the crease. Don't keep your hopes so high. This team is not that timid like you think it is. Okay. Okay. Let's watch the match. In another five minutes everything will be black and white. 3. New business. So, how is your new business coming along? Okay, not that bad. Things were bad, but now things are looking up. This pandemic really afflicted many businesses and hurt the economy. Yes. In fact we had to thrust our business but we refused to be subdued. Exactly. We can't be terrified and let the situation take over us. We need to be more observant. The government is planning to stimulate the economy with a new package. Yeah, let's hope so, because they are always used to dishing out white lies. Yeah. Let's keep our fingers crossed. 4. Going to the doctor. Hello, doctor. Yes, come in. Tell me, what happened? My son is not keeping well. He was doing fine and out of the blue he started crying and pain. The signs are not looking good. Okay. Let me take a look. Come here, son. Hmm. Nothing to worry. He's got an upset stomach. Oh. Thank God. I was so worried. I understand. For every parent, their child is the apple of their eye. I was astounded when he began to stagger in the hall while walking. You are highly vexed. Just relax, I will give this vaccine, and it will help to stimulate his immune system. 5. At work. Oof. I'm fed up. Why they always thrust all this work on my head? Well, I haven't noticed it. This is actually quite normal. Everyone feels like that. Or probably you are too timid. Well, if they think that, then I won't be subdued for long. I will look for a new job somewhere else. You seem to be afflicted by so much work, but remember, hard work always bears fruits. I have been working since three years now. I don't see any promotion or increment coming my way. Well, if you take my advice, our bosses are quite observant and who knows from out of the blue, you may get a raise or a promotion. I'll keep my fingers crossed. 6. At the party. Come fast. Look. The sky, isn't it spectacular? Wow. You're right. This is amazing. Thanks for inviting me to your place for this Diwali. These beautiful firecrackers and lightings don't always look so great. But this time it is like from something out of the blue. Exactly. This happens rarely like once in a blue moon. The lighting is widespread and we celebrate this all over the country. It is a time to enjoy the boon of our great motherland. Yes. But the noise is vexing. I feel sad for the animals. It must be quite a terrifying experience for them. Thank you for investing in your future. Like, share and subscribe.